We the champs in the zone, east coast to west, every throne known and shown, box and unbiased truth in every puff piece, power pound kings, the talks never see, check the stats, fight stack, gloves flying fast, KOs rewinding, every punch lands last, jabs like poetry, hooks like history, uncover the mystery, every fight a victory, check the stats, fight stack, gloves flying fast, KOs rewinding, every punch lands last, jabs like poetry, hooks like history, uncover the mystery, every fight a victory, prime time, prime time, Grind, every rhyme so refined True to the sport, no bias, we shine Fist up in the ring, our voices do sing From 9 to 90 at night, we the boxing king East to west, coast to coast Prime time the most, raising every toast Talk so smooth, flow with venom Truth in the rhythm, no biased algorithm Analysts breaking down round a glorious round Unbiased coverage making the sound profound Fighter profiles every style compiled Dames by strategy casuals beat beguiled Prime time prime grind every rhyme so refined True to the sport no bias we shine Fist up in the ring our voices do sing From 9 to 90 at night we the boxing king Really well. Oh man, so let's go ahead and jump on on into this video, shall we? Man, oh man, we are on only a few hours away from the biggest, and I do mean one of the biggest fights of all time. You talking about the undisputed light heavyweight championship of the world, Bivol versus. Better be for the undisputed light heavyweight championship of the world coming from Primetime Talk TV. Good God Almighty, you can see it, you can feel it, it's almost there, and you can't conceal it. Boy, these two guys, these two athletes, these two dominant forces, these two boxing icons. Cons are going to head off in the ring and put their undefeated, undisputed zero against zero, belt against belts, and somebody is going to leave undisputed champion. Mm, mm, mm. A boxing man's dream or woman. A boxer's dream is to become undisputed one day. Everyone. They can lie, fake all they want and say that, oh, it don't mean nothing, but it do. It do, to the right ones anyway. You know, now if you in it for the money game, hey, it don't matter. Belts don't matter. That's what they say. But to all the boxing historians, the true boxing fans, the true boxing experts, the boxing connoisseurs around the world, they understand. And they look for fights like this. They look for moments like this. Two athletes, two fighters that are willing to get in the ring and put their reputation on the line put their belts on the line, put their legacy on the line in some instances. It gets no bigger than this. And Bival with his, man, Soviet Union style in and out boxing, his jabbing, his reach, his range, his speed, his accuracy. Mm. And then you have better be Someone that seems to be a knockout artist. A Picasso with putting fighters to sleep. He is 20 fights in with 20 knockouts. No one has left the ring unscathed. No one has left the ring on their feet dealing with this guy he has knocked everyone out do you understand the words that are coming out of my mouth will Bavall be able to stay out of the range of this guy punches his knockout power 
Paul would better be catch him like he has caught everyone else and leave Baval stumbling and humbled, wondering what happened, what went wrong. What did I do wrong to get caught with something that I practiced so hard to not get caught with? It's all going down on Saturday, y'all. It's not too far away now. And of course, the card is stacked. I mean, you know, <laughs> I don't even want to talk about the rest of the card. I will let you go and search for yourself and see who else is on that card. I will tell you this much, Ben Whitaker is up there, and he's being tested with a fighter that says he will be Ben Whitaker's biggest test yet. That's just one I talk about, all right? And I'm going to leave that alone. But this Baval and Better Beave is all you need to see, all you need to wait for, all you need to know, and all you need to get that pay-per-view for if you get it at all, period. You need to get it. You need to sh support these fighters in their endeavors and what they're doing. They're putting their life on the line. And you got people out here that's willing to still cheat and get by and pirate fights. And you know you need to go ahead and get that fight. You're going to waste that money on something else. Why not put it in on a fight and become a part of history? Be able to brag and say, yo, yeah, I copped that fight. That fight was worth it. Because this is a historic fight These two fighters here are not going to hug They are not going to dance They are not going to run away from each other It is going to be a battle A war Do you understand The words that are coming out of my mouth This is a once in a lifetime type of fight It really is You know I know you're thinking like Oh Man, prime time getting paid to hype this fight up. No, I'm not, actually. I'm doing this for free. <laughs> if you ask me, I just love the sport of boxing. I love moments like this. I love fights like this. I love to see fighters put it all on the line like this. Because it's rare we get good fights. We always get hand-me-down fights, fights that, you know, we weren't expecting to get, but we got it. It was good, it was pleasing, but it wasn't what we desired. We are asking for an assembly line of fights. We are asking for fighters that fight when they supposed to fight and not duck when they supposed to duck <laughs> because they can duck, but actually say no. You know what? I'm gonna put it all on the line. I'm going to fight this fight. I'm going to fight this fighter. I want what he got. I want that spot. I want everybody to consider me the greatest in the world. I want to consider myself the greatest in the world. I want to prove it to myself first. And then I want to prove it to the people that doubted me second. You know, use that motivation, you know, when people are hating on you. That's what you're supposed to do. And a lot of people are counting Bivol out. They're saying he's going to get knocked out. And you got some people that's counting Better Beave out, saying that Bivol is too good. He beat Canelo. Who do you think is going to win? That's what I want to know. Who do you think is going to win? Tomorrow morning, I'll tell you who I think is going to win. But Right now, I just want to bask in these guys' strength and power and courage to put on a fight like this, to do what needs to be done, to fight the fight that needs to be fought, to not run and hide and cower away and shy away from the big fights, the big moments, the big names, the big belts, the big challenges. So many other fighters make you wait and debate on those big fights. But these two guys right here put their name in the battle of the Hall of Fame after this. Because I guarantee you this is going to go down as one of the greatest lightweight, heavyweight, light heavyweight championships. Undisputed 
of all time in history. For real. I'm I'm pretty sure it's going to match up to that. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure it's not going to be an early fight. I'm pretty sure it's not going to be a long fight either. <laughs> Those are two things I'm sure of. Somebody is getting knocked out. Somebody is going to go to sleep. Somebody's going to get drugged. Somebody's going to get overwhelmed. I believe there's going to be a unanimous decision or either a KO in this fight, period. And it may even be some knockdowns. It may even be some stumbles and rumbles. But these guys are not going to give up until somebody put them down all the way. These are two gladiators. These are two warriors from different places in the world. At the same time, now we'll collide and put it all on the line. And one man will be victorious. And one man will walk away with all four belts. Who will it be? Will it be Arthur? Better be. Or will it be Dimitri Bivar? Mm, boy, this is a big fight, y'all. This is a big moment in boxing right now. So I hope you read it. So anyway, with that being said, that's all I got for this video. You already know the routine when you leave my house. Hit that like button, hit the subscribe button, smash the bell icon so you can be notified the next time I drop these next latest and greatest videos here on Primetime Talk TV and I'm on social media everywhere. And definitely go to the website, primetimetalktv.com and copy some merch. All right, y'all. Peace, love, I'm out till next time. Primetime.